What you need? It's what you need. All right, you guys. I am with. Yes, I'm not even gonna say her name because she needs no introduction, at all. But. All right, whatever. Sugar T, how are you doing, girl? You are looking hot as usual. I'm loving the the little outfit. Did you choose, did you pick that out yourself, or did your uh, fashionable dress people do that for you? Uh, just my daughter picked it out. <laughs> your daughter? How old your daughter? Nineteen. Nineteen. Mm -hmm. Okay, so tell us a little bit about what you're doing. We want to know all the behind the scenes things that nobody knows. You got to give us what we need to know. It's called What You Need TV. Okay. I know we just got this, you know, little meeting with with detail and everything, but mm -hmm. I'm gonna let you tell them what's going on. Cool, cool. Um, well, hey, what y'all need? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> it's cool. Um, you guys can always check out my website. It's just you know I have a couple of ventures that I've been dealing with for the last. A uh, few years, excuse me, and one of them is pretty much my new fragrance line by um, already branded Sprinkle Me Fragrances. And you can always go to sprinkleme.biz and check it out. It's a lot of opportunities for individuals if they, you know, need job, extra money. There's a um, system that we have created where, you know, we offer the products wholesale and we let people make money and sell them out the trunk. And then um, we also have it where you can get them online and buy the products. And um, we offer training and workshops. It's an empowerment line. So Sugar Water is our first signature smell, which is a sweet smell for the strong woman. Comes on sweet and stays fresh and clean all day. And yep. <sighs> doesn't <it> smell good. <laughs> and the goal is to put it on every day. And when you put it on, you're supposed to come back fresh no matter what you went through the day before or that morning or that night. Whatever, you just get fresh and clean and you start it new and you become that sweet, strong woman. Still be strong, but stay sweet, which is a very challenging um, balance sometimes. So that's been a, 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 new, a newer venture. It's been my baby through my corporation, Inspirations by Sugar Corporation. And then I also do some youth and family service uh, projects, which right now we're doing a movement. It's called the Be About It movement. So the program is called Be About Your Business. Against All Odds is one of our youth and family workshops um, catered to adults and catered to um, older, the older crowd as well as the young crowd and teen mothers. And then um, we do a Be About Your Business professional life skills program to the youth, you know, kind of giving them realistic views of being successful and giving them the tools and the understand standing of the other side what they don't normally see you know what i'm saying um and also um so that's pretty much one of the movements that we're starting so through the movement is the whole empowerment thing which is the youth and family services the um fragrance sugar water and its endeavors and then my new album which is um as you know, Detail is going to definitely lace us with some nice hot tracks. Deta Detail works with Akon and working with Snoop, and he's a wonderful producer, and he's going, uh, he's pretty much uh, taking on uh, the project. And then I have some other producers that's working on it. Um, Mel, which is calling itself Smooth, and um, my nephew, who is Droopy, and groomed by my brother, E-40, and um, DJ Pizzo, who has been our family DJ with E-40 and the Click for quite a while, and then uh, some other producers that are banging out some hot stuff. So um, those are the, the main endeavors these days. And, of course, I'm always open for acting. I'm working on some television projects that you guys should look out for and, you know, and just keep it moving. A couple of television Boy, projects. That now, took would, a you, long time. Would, would you say that music runs in the family? You know, you got E-40 and everybody else. Would you say that's why you got into music, or is there another story behind that? Oh, definitely. The, actually, we originated in the choir, singing in church. My grandfather and my grandmother was a preacher and a preacher's wife, and uh, ran a church since I was born, and we just grew up kind of singing in the choir. So, for some odd reason, they always stuck me in front to do all the singing. <laughs> Jesus loves me, yeah. this I know, for the Bible, she was supposed to go with me, but okay. For the Bible tells me so, yeah, so, you know, I liked it, the, um, I liked it, the, um, 
I may not be the best of anything, nor have the best. You know, it's like the hook goes, his name is Jesus, righteous son of God, lily of the valley, bright and morning star. But anyway, so. <laughs> <laughs> I love a sweet transition. <laughs> That's kind of like where it originally started. Then we kind of got into the hip hop world, which my brother it, they started it, and you know, I pretty much was just a tag alone to go and play baseball, play football, play basketball until my breasts got too big. And then, you know, <laughs> <laughs> yep, I wouldn't say too big, but definitely comfortable. <laughs> okay, to the courts, you know, they used to come to the basketball game just to see me running up and down the courts, <laughs> and I realized that's what they was doing. They're like, look at her, but you should have been here last night. <laughs> You should have been here last night. You know, Mr. Jerry Stackhouse was here, right? Wow. Made yeah. the three-pointer shot in the Mavericks last, last night. Oh, my God. Oh, I should have been here last night. She missed out. Missed out. I was recording in the studio, so I couldn't just bounce. But I'm, I'm going to be back. Don't worry. You just keep letting me know what's up. So, you know, from the choir, um, we took it to the streets. And then from the streets, we, you know, the sports, the whatever that, you know, that made sense to making money and making um, uh, movement. And then that's how I ended up in music. Right on. Well, you know, mix a little choir with a little What You Need TV and a little hip hop. And you come up with a cool little hip hop What You Need TV choir stew. Yep. Maybe we can do a, um, a track for the TV show. Yes, that's going to be hot. A lot of stuff coming up as far as that goes, you guys. WhatYouNeedTV.com coming soon. We're giving you all the exclusive interviews and everything you need to know before it happens. So keep watching, keep listening, tell your friends. Now, before we let you go, Miss Sugar T, do you have any comments for your friends and family? Yeah, I rap sure. a little bit. Sure. <laughs> I like that. That kind of rhymed. <laughs> hey, you can finish your rap album. That's coming soon. Okay. Cool. So, you know, pretty much, um, how did I end up with this? Because you're, you're, you're used to it. You're an artist. That is so true. <laughs> oh, I'm horrible. Well, I'll do that. Yeah. <laughs> I, um, you know what? My, what I want to say to my family, friends, and fans, just thank you for being supportive. And don't let the smooth taste fool you. And don't underestimate. And don't overestimate. And put God first. It's God, family, and then your money and your endeavors. So if you do that, you'll be happy, you'll be at peace, and you'll um, have longevity in all your endeavors. So peace and blessings, and always look out for me, Sugar T. I ain't going nowhere. Google me anytime you want to know what's going on. Sugar T, S-U-G-A slash T. Sugar T, the sister of E-40 on What You Need TV. I'm your man, Easy. Peace.